Viewers, welcome back to the coach's desk with host coach Minzy. And I'm here to inform you that veteran defender, Jamaica's international O'Neill Fisher, who has been a free agent, um, he has now signed a deal with LA Galaxy. So yes, O'Neill Fisher will be playing in LA. The Jamaican international has made uh, 66 appearances in Major League Soccer um, since 2015. He was playing uh, with clubs like Seattle Saunders, DC United. You know what I mean? Um, now the club is very excited uh, to have O'Neill on board. Uh, the general manager is, is, is saying that he's pretty excited because, of course, the reggae boy is a very talented um, individual and he knows a lot about the back line he brings a level of versatility to the um the club and a whole lot of experience in the defense of the la galaxy team now uh fisher he has played for the reggae boys 15 times um had started in 15 appearance in the in 2020 with dc united now there was a situation with his contract the option um was declined at the season's conclusion, that is contract option. Um, he missed the 29th season after undergoing surgery with a partial torn ACL, MCL, PCL, and a medial meniscus. He suffered that in 2018, the latter part of the season. Um, so um, it, 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 it is a, 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 a big move for the reggae boys reggae boy there um fisher so this simply means that he would have been given playing time um in the mls so let, let's look uh, at where um o'neill is coming from um he, he is a former uh saint george's uh sc that's where his youth career started um before he actually moved to the u.s college he went to the kyla that's a tyler junior college uh, um that's where he started out then he, he was transferred to the university of new mexico um, played pretty well for them over there um, he also played in the premier development league for jersey express and in the national uh Premier Soccer League for New York Red Bulls. That's the under-23 uh, team. So he joined the uh, Seattle uh, Saunders, as I said before, as a pick in the second round, 40th, um, in the MLS Super Draft in 2015. Um, he signed a professional contract with the club two months later. So that was good for him. Uh, he made his debut in the USL affiliate um seattle saunders 2-0 sorry seattle saunders fc a uh, 4-2 victory over defending usl champion sacramento republic fc um he then went to dc united in 2018 um and he would he would have been doing extremely well um they re-signed him there and then he has been playing football now of course he, he got an injury injury sometime um, in that period um, he returned from that injury in 2020 that's in march played uh, that first game of it against um inter miami yes now dc released him in november 2020 so he was out of a contract since November. Um, that was after the game in Saudi Arabia. So that was good for him where that game, game is concerned because that would have allowed him to, you know, um, be seen by LA. They, they quickly grab him. And of course, he's now a LA Galaxy player. So, um, Fisher made his international debut for Jamaica um, against Trinidad and Tobago. Um, 
He played for the under 20 team as well, under 20 championship. So, um, all in all, he would have also um, won the MLS Cup in 2016 with Seattle Saunders. So, he's a, and like, like LA said, that he would have been an experienced player. It's a good pickup for them. We just hope that um, he'll continue to, to, to play well and do what he, he does best, um, defending. Not not only defending, you know, just 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 throwing this out there. Um, O'Neill Fisher is a is a formidable midfielder, you know? so he's versatile that way. You understand? So you have to watch your position there in the midfield, and that's why he played that defensive um, uh, left back position so well because he understands the flanks. So he he's a good player. Um, we trust that he'll be a part of this. I do believe that he, he, he can hold on a, 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 a solid position in the Jamaica setup. Yes, he, he, he's one of our better defenders. Um, yes, he's one of our better defenders. And I, I, I wouldn't leave him out of the squad, if you'd ask me, in terms of uh, Gold Cup as well as World Cup qualifiers. Games will be coming quick and fast. And uh, of course you have to rotate players and all of those things. So O'Neill Fisher is a good baller to have. Yeah man, very good baller to have. And uh, we are happy that he has been given another opportunity to play some football over there in LA. We, we know that he'll make best use of it. He seemed to be a level-headed um, kid. Um... Barring injuries that would have sidelined him for a while, he seemed to be in good nick. He played excellent um, against Saudi Arabia in our in our last um, international game there. So we we'll lift our hats off to to O'Neill for finding a club. Kudos to his agent because you know it's pretty tough now to get um, clubs for players, especially in this time um so la galaxy they welcome the man and um it, it's pretty interesting also because he'll be going up against nine other defenders for position not sure how many of them are are are, are the, the the outside defenders but i mean they have a pretty uh, good squad there, big squad. So, um, seem to be a, a, a good unit that he's going to be a part of. Um, gain some experience playing in the MLS again. Um, so that he can own his craft again. So he'll bring some experience to the Jamaican team when they go up against the United States. Because he would know some of these players. Yes. So, we wish O'Neill Fisher all the best in his endeavors, in his footballing career. Um, we trust that he'll remain healthy. Because, you know, sometimes um, players coming off injuries, it has a psychological effect on them. So, we hope that his psyche is up and running. Um, he's a professional, of course. So, we, we trust that he'll get over those um, hurdles pretty quick so that he will do well for his team as well as the national team because we do need his quality in the defense there he plays um overlapping very well he defends well um when i watch the game in saudi arabia i've never seen him out of position um he tracks well so yeah man he's a he's a pretty decent baller yeah man i uh, 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 to date even though that is just one game to date, I've not seen where um, there are weaknesses in his game right now from what I saw down there in Saudi Arabia. But going forward, I'll be paying keen attention to that because you know that is important. Um, if, he, if he wants to hold down a, a, a starting position, um, he'd have to turn up for LA, hoping that he, he plays in their starting lineup as well. So, 
big up yourself um O'Neill happy that you have a club happy that you be playing some football you understand get yourself ready match fitness match sharpness so that when it comes to being called up for an international game or um what you'd say a a, a competition the tournament that is coming up and the world cup qualifiers um you'll be in peak form fitness up game fitness sharpness is up and you'll be able to assist the team in qualifying for this world cup coming up yeah man we do believe that we have a good set of youngsters good good team um majority of them are playing barring ravel morris we don't know what is happening with him however uh most of the players are playing right now so definitely that's a good look so congratulations again to O'Neill Fisher, LA Galaxy, signed the free agent, and he's now in the squad. He's going to be playing some football. Big up yourself, O'Neill Fisher. Thanks again for tuning, tuning in to the coach's desk. Of course, you know that we give the latest updates and all of that. Thank you very much. Big up yourself. Um, we need about 100 likes on this video, people. Run it up. See? And remember to tell a friend to tell a friend about Coach's Desk. Guess what? We have some more big interviews coming up in our people. Stay tuned to the Coach's Desk. You can't afford to miss it. Yeah, man, some big interview. Another banger. Another outstanding former player will add to our interview list. Stay tuned. I'm out. <laughs>